Okay, I am Cherry Berry, and you're seeing this picture because you're not going to look at me. Okay, now, <clears throat> I was given 10 que Christmas questions, and I will do this. Okay, number one, when do you start getting excited for Christmas? Well, all these questions I'm going to answer, are they're, they're going to be from the time when I was little. <clears throat> okay, uh, because I don't get excited anymore for Christmas. I don't really celebrate it anymore. Because I just can't get past the fact that my mom has been gone for 16 years. And I, I just can't deal with any holidays so this is what i'm going to say from my childhood not childhood like in my teen years okay when do you start getting excited for christmas well i used to get excited um at around thanksgiving i say that because i know it was time to put up the tree write the list out and help my mom make cookies or prepare to get cookies. And she always had one cabinet full for cookies, like sugars and flowers and herbs and spices and whatnot. So that's... And she always says, don't nobody go into this cabinet because it's only for making Christmas cookies. All right, number two, do you use an advent calendar? Well, I made one, and I stopped on day five because mine is a witchy advent calendar, and I burned uh, my herbs and stuff that I made. It's just, it's too much on me. For a person like me trying to stop smoking again and then Burning all that just really got to me. <clears throat> all right, my favorite Christmas music, M movie, excuse me. Well, it is Home Alone, one and two only. And Nightmare Before Christmas, of course. Uh, people say that's not nothing to do with Christmas, but I think it is. And just just stuff like that. Okay, what's my typical day Christmas day like? Well, we used to um, go. We, we used to wake up. Well, I used to sleep underneath the Christmas tree. And then my mom would wake me up. She'd be like, um, Santa came, all this other, and I find myself in bed because there, there was presents under the tree. So I, um, I guess there was no room or something, so they put me in my bed. I don't know. So we would gather around and we would open up the gifts and everything, and we would give our mother, her Christmas gifts, and um, <clears throat> watch uh, the little cartoons that come around each year. Number five, what do you eat for Christmas? Well, we used to eat ham and stuff. I mean, now it's like Well, now, well, I'm not going to talk about now, but, yeah, we used to eat ham and stuffing and just, you know, stuff like that. And Christmas cookies that my mom made. Um, do you have any Christmas traditions? Um, we used to. We used to go uh, Christmas caroling. And we used to um, do the... Uh, Traditional, um, 
decorating of the tree and stuff. Okay, funny Christmas moment. Well, the, the, okay, the funniest Christmas moment I had when I had to use the bathroom and I saw my brother trying to squeeze his fat butt into a Santa Claus outfit and he was behind the bathroom door and he didn't know that I was there and I didn't know he was there because the lights were off and it scared me to death because get out get out and I was like oh my god I said, I'm using the bathroom so I seen I seen the Christmas hat Santa's hat fall to the floor I was like Okay, maybe that's Santa or something. It sounded like my brother. I was like, I don't know. But yeah. So after I was done using the bathroom, the door shut behind me and I proceeded to get dressed. But, all right. What was my favorite Christmas gift? Well, since I had my son in November, he, he's been my Christmas gift for the rest of my life. But there's really not a best gift that I ever got I adored each one the same. So do you get a real tree or a fake tree? I get a fake tree. Not that I care about ripping down trees because, you know, if you need a tree or some kind of wood lumber and there's nothing else available and you're like 30 feet of snow and you're covered in, what else are you going to do is rip down a tree from the... The fields and stuff okay but the fake ones are better because you don't have to put an aspirin in the water every time you turn around um, pine needles don't get everywhere and you just pack it up take take it down and pack it up and wait for next year each year we leave the Christmas lights on we just take the ornaments off and my favorite candy is the spearmint leaves. The gummy spearmint leaves. Okay. That was 7 minutes and 34 seconds of jibber drawing. So I'm going to pass the torch to somebody else. Bye.